Hello. Welcome back to a day in our life. Today is Tuesday and the kids and I are just getting kind of bored. We are, we played outside a little bit. Eloise only took like a 20 minute nap. So she's just like not real thrilled because she didn't get a good solid nap. So she's a little bit hard to please. And I think we all just need to get out of the house. But unfortunately it's like yucky. It's really gross out. It's rainy and cold. So what we're gonna do is go to Target, I think, and get a sticker book. Tickle. They absolutely love the sticker book that they've been doing and they need a new one because they're out of stickers. So we're gonna go see what we can find in the way of a sticker book or some type of activity book. I'm gonna be attempting, I think, for the first time. Get a little bit wrong, wrong way. Yeah, let's bring it over here. Oh, so we can talk to the camera while we get your shoes on. I think this might be the first time I'm attempting to take all three out by myself. I do that on. Nope, this one goes on this foot. I'm just gonna help you because we're kind of in a hurry. This is a really interesting stage where they just really want to do it themselves, but they're not fast enough. I went ahead and put this on because I figure I'm gonna wear her for fear of someone making fun of me again. I did mention before when the twins were little that I was like, I was nervous about taking both of them to the grocery store at the same time because they were still pretty little and I wasn't sure how to like arrange them in the cart and someone. Yeah, Eloise needs her butterfly, doesn't she? Somebody was just really rude about me, like not having common sense to put twins in a shopping cart. We all figured it out, but with three, it takes it to a new level. Uh, Target has these great shopping carts where they have two seats and then a cart off of the front of that, but that's only two seats. Eloise can't sit up on her own yet, so I figure I'll wear her, put the twins in the cart. I'm not sure though. If there's not one of those carts out by the car, then carrying baby Eloise in with her carrier and holding both of the twins' hands is impossible. So I think I'll just, no matter what, have to wear her, hold the twins' hands. It's gonna be interesting. We'll see how it goes. Lyndall, did you pick out your own outfit? No sock. No sock. What's on your outfit? Apple. That's right, it's so pretty. Do you love it? Love it. Love Good. <laughs> Bear, what's on your shirt, Mama. buddy? Hey, Bear, what's on your shirt? Never mind. Well, we did it. You guys excited? Yeah. You know what, this little dollar area probably has sticker books. Although, my whole sustainability kick, this isn't really fitting. But they really get a lot of enjoyment out of sticker books. Ooh, this one's coloring. And, are those sticker and stickers? Let's get a couple of those. Probably both frozen, although they do have Paw Patrol. They don't really care about Paw Patrol. There's a play pack, a surprise play pack. I wonder what that means. Collect all four characters, one set. Grab and go. Includes surprise foam characters, sticker sheets, one stencil, one velvet poster, eight crayons, 32 page full size coloring book. Done. Lyndall thinks this is hilarious. What is that? What's in there? Is it a doggy? That's hilarious. Is this another doggy? Is that wow. what you guys were talking about? Did I just run over something? That's right. That is a doggy, isn't it? I didn't know what you guys were talking about. You weren't lying. There really is a doggy there. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes, doggy. Yes, doggy. Yeah. <laughs> Mommy needs some Starbucks. Another doggy. Yay. Yay. Neat. Ooh, Tupperware. Tupperware. Wow. Oh, a, a lunch bag. Yeah. A lunch bag. Ooh, an Instapot. Wow. Ooh, a water bottle. Neat. 
else? Oh, a food saver. More Tupperware. Yeah, cool. I actually really, really love these. Yeah, pop top. I like to put all my pasta and stuff in those. Oh, that's a rug. It's a pretty rug. Ooh, food. Ooh, wine. wearing this sweatshirt in like every vlog. <laughs> Did you take the sticker off? Yes. Who's on that sticker? Snowman. A snowman? What's his name? Do you remember? Yes. Frosty. Frosty? That, that Frosty is also a snowman. Do you know what the snowman in Frozen's name is? Oh. Princess Anna. Princess Anna's in Frozen. What's the snowman's name, though? Olaf. Olaf, that's right. Olaf. That's Olaf. He's a snowman, too, just like Frosty. Queen Elsa made Olaf, because she can make snow, right? Yeah. Who's on your, who's on your paper? This is um, Queen Elsa. That's right. Who's, or what's this? We A what? Leaf, leaf. leaf, yeah. Princess Anna. Oh, another Princess Anna. Do you have a tree? We've kind of mutilated the sticker pages. These weren't the highest quality. It's mommy, shocking since mommy, they were on the, it off. Mommy, it off. the like, dollar mommy, section. It off. I guess I might have been in like the. Mommy, rip it off. Mommy, rip it off. Mommy, rip it off. I might have been in like the party section instead of the kids toy section and that might be why they were more expensive but a page of stickers like 125 stickers was $4.99 I thought that was ridiculous so I didn't get any more stickers I just I'm not paying five dollars for a page of stickers mm -mm. Yes, I did. We all did. So this is a heck of a lot easier than mounting that squat rack, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I hope so. I'm kind of embarrassing that it took us this long to anchor these down. We should have done this a long time ago. But they're in the closet and the kids have only recently even been able to reach the handles. Right. So it yeah, is. So I researched uh, basically wall anchors to anchor the dressers down so that they won't pop over. And these will hold like 125 or 130 pounds. Wow. Yeah, they were super cheap. They're on Amazon. I'll link it below. And we're also gonna do the things in the garage. Not that they're ever unattended out there, but just in case. We also need to flip these door handles so they can't lock themselves in their bedrooms. A lot of baby proofing going on here. What do you think, Rusty? Are you gonna be able to climb on the dressers now? What are you guys watching? Uh, cool. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah! Good job, Linda. Good job. <laughs> She's like an actress. Yeah. She was done she saw, a drink. Exactly. She saw me reach for the camera and picked it up again. Good job. <laughs> That's a big cup. <laughs> Children, bear, we need you to we need you to get serious for just a minute. Lindell, we have a serious conversation. We need to be serious. So tomorrow, we're leaving. We're going to Columbia, Missouri, because your sister, Eloise, your four-month-old sister Eloise, is requiring. 
surgery. An operation. I feel like you're not listening to me, Bear. Due to a duplex kidney system. Do you understand? Eloise has an extra ureter. Can you say ureter? Do you even know what a ureter is? Do you guys even care that your baby sister's going in for an operation? Who's gonna stay with you while we're gone? Mom. Mm -hmm. You know that. That's... I don't think so. No, sister. I don't think they could care less. On another serious note, Lyndall, you were not named after the marijuana czar, Lyndall Franker. For one thing, it's spelled different. Man, I'm really glad we changed the spelling of Lyndall. No kidding. Otherwise, people would think that she's the marijuana czar of Missouri. I know. She is pretty advanced. Yeah. Hey, Linda, we don't eat with our feet on the table, honey. Put your foot down. Thank, Thank you. you. Good job. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> we don't put feet on the table. You little, <laughs> so hard to not you little actress. <laughs> Did you guys? Lindo, Lindo, you're a really good kid to have a vlog with. Yes, you are. You're very You little show, showman. Did you see my placemat? <laughs> Hashtag mom life. I don't know why she has drool rush. Where's your bib, sister? It was all wet. <laughs> Shut up. Lindo. Yucky. Yeah. <laughs>